because your world is still too circumstantially derived. Say, same thing, you say. In other words, you, you still hope that feelings are caused by something, They're caused by circumstance, caused by uh, others or events or something, or caused by your own thinking. And so that, you know, then if you are setting out to, say, create joy, well, if you had a joyful occasion, whatever it is, I don't know, a baby's born or something, and you feel overwhelming joy, say, or fear. <laughs> you, say, you say, ah, well, that's genuine. Because I have a reason to feel joy, see? It's genuine. But when you just create it out of the blue, you say, I'm faking it. I'm faking it. There's no reason. That's because you don't really know what joy is. See? And you don't grasp that you're creating it when you're relating to the circumstance. See? Or your facial thing. So you can do that and then help, help link your brain. See? But you're still see, trying to get yourself tricked into it, so to speak. You see, he's trying to do something, find a circumstance, so you can create it. Okay, all right, do what you gotta do for now. But then move into, right out, just right out of the gate. Just that emotion, boom. Then you just create it, right out of the gate. Boom. Okay. Without, and genuine, it's like, you actually feel it. You see, you feel it. You feel it, Jen, just as much as you would if they were circumstantially derived, you see? Like, boom. Oh, good. But as long as you are still caught in this, this belief, this assumption that you're simply at the effect of circumstance, and that you're not really involved in creating it. Then you're stuck in that, right? You're stuck in that. So you have to create some kind of scenario or uh, 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 circumstance uh, or fake a circumstance, kind of like a, you know, like, a, like a ball and chain or whatever you're saying, to, to generate something. But I would say you're not, not conscious enough then if, you're not getting that you're really doing it, that you're really doing it. You're still holding on, so you're not like you're really doing it. You, 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 intellectually, you might have the belief like, that you're doing it, see, but you're not getting it. That's not an experience for you, so you're not genuinely. See, so keep working it until it is, see? So it is, it's like, bam, look, I can do this, look, I can do this. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I remember a long time ago, I saw a, a show with, um, Mork and Mindy with uh, Robbins, um, Robin Williams, Robin Williams, Robin Williams, right? And I, I didn't know Robin Williams, and it, and it happened to be a really good one. And she, uh, this, he's an alien. He's supposed to be an alien, and he doesn't know. It's a comedy, right? And he doesn't know. You ever seen that? Anyway, he doesn't, he doesn't know how humans work, right? Particularly. So you're going to this discussion, and he says, Oh, you know, and he's been working on this stuff. And he says, okay, so you do emotions. And so then he goes and he does. He goes anger, joy, fear, you know. He just does like a dozen emotions, one after the other. And his body, demeanor, everything just changed. He was really good. I was impressed. Like he's really feeling that emotion and bringing it, see, because he's an actor, right, see, he's good, he's also a comedian, see, and, but he's actually, he's good, you know, I was impressed, he wasn't just pretending to do fear, he was doing fear, he was doing anger, he was doing joy, he was just, ba-dam, 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 and he would, you know, he'd call it out, do it, call it out, do it, call it out, do it, and it was quite impressive. 